Hi guys, this is Rosita Applebaum and I'm here with a tutorial. I know, finally. Um, it is this look that I'm wearing right now. It is a, I would say, pretty much a daytime smoky eye. I guess you can use this for like a date or um, if you're going to, I don't know, like I would wear this out to work or something. It depends where you work, but yeah, so it's just basic smoky eye. I use the Naked Basics palette as well as the Infallible Ice Latte pigment. On my lips, I'm wearing Too Faced Naughty Nude. It's this really pretty nude color. And on top, I wore this Clarins Eclat Minute um, Instant Light Natural Lip Perfector. And I think it's Rose Shimmer. It doesn't say on the actual packaging, but it's the brownish one. It's basically like a lip gloss, um, and it's very brown. So I put that over like a nude to create this. And on my cheeks, I'm wearing Warm Soul by MAC. My top is from Forever 21. It's a crop top, and it's from Forever 21. It was only 7 bucks. This ring, I'm always wearing. They're from H&M and Forever 21. I always wear these rings. My hair is basic, like, every time. My eyebrows are a little bit lighter today because I did put the Anastasia Brow Wiz on top. I'm kind of testing it out. It looks a lot lighter on camera than in person, but... I figured I'd try it out today. The foundation that I'm wearing today is Lancome Taint Miracle and I'm pretty much obsessed with it. It covers really well and it's a flawless finish. Um, yeah, so if you would like to see this look, keep on watching. Bye guys. So what we're going to do is we're going to get started with priming our eye and I'm using Urban Decay Primer Potion in the color Eden. It's kind of like a concealer color. Um, you can use like a, paint, a Paintily Paint Pot Soft Ochre by MAC or even just like the original Urban Decay um, Primer Potion but I just like this one because it cancels out any like redness that you have in your eye so I really like that or like veins if you have like veiny eyelids or anything like that so we're just going to with our fingers kind of melt that into our skin and I do it from lid to brow bone and just kind of smooth it out because this one is a little bit drier like the formula um, compared to the original by Urban Decay so I also put it under my eye because we're going to be putting some shadows so once there. that's done I'm going to be taking this brush it's by Sonia Kasha it's just like a dome shaped brush. You can use any brush that kind of just like packs on color, I guess. I don't really have too many brushes. I'm working on that. So I'm taking the color Foxy from the Naked Basics palette. It's a yellow based um, all over eyelid color. And I'm also taking WOS. It's like a pinky color. So I'm mixing those together and I'm putting this all over my eye. And sorry that I'm using the mirror. Um, I just have to use it. <laughs> because I have to see what I'm doing so just take that all over your lid this is just a base color you can hear Justin Bieber in the back because I love Justin Bieber so put this literally all over your eye And it should just look like this. Okay. Once you're done with putting that all over your eye, what I'm going to be doing is taking this brush. It's the MAC 224. It's a big fluffy brush. And I'm taking the color Naked 2 and a little bit of faint, like a bit of it, and just kind of mixing it, but more of Naked 2. And I'm going to be putting this in the outer corner of my eye and blending it inwards tap off any excess so that you don't get like fallout under your eye and what I do is I basically just um, look at the mirror at like an angle and then just see where my crease is and just take this in there and so I'm bringing it all the way so I kind of hold the brush in place and bring it inwards What I'm going to be doing is taking um, this 217 brush by MAC. 
and the black color well it's like a dark dark brown it's called crave and it's very very pigmented so I literally take like one dot of it because it's very pigmented and I'm gonna focus this on the really outer portion of my eye and so once I put down a dot what I'll do is I'll take like a paper towel and just kind of clean my brush a little bit because I don't want this to be super super intense black but I do like like a hint like a nudge of black so I'll just kind of focus this on the outer corner and bring it in a little bit. You can leave your eye just like this and just keep on blending but I wanted to put this infallible ice latte. It's like a pigment. It's a pressed pigment basically and what I do is I take um, any brush. This is the e.l.f. eyeshadow C brush and I will spray Fix Plus on it. This one's like done but I just like use whatever's left. You can use like water, um, a mixing medium, anything really. This is just going to make the pigment a lot, like it's going to stand out a lot more. And so I just press my brush into the pigment. And I'm going to focus this on this section here. And so I just press it in. And if you brush it, it'll like also do a lot of like intensity. So I just kind of brush this on and also on the inner corner and it's okay if it blends into your darker colors So once you've basically put it over the other color, you want to go back with um, your 224 and the color Naked 2 and just blend Naked 2 in. And I'm going to take the Sonia Kashuk with the color Foxy and Venus, which are the two um, front colors, and I'm going to apply this to my highlight mainly foxy because I want this part of my brow bone to be pretty matte and then Venus on the inner corner and now I'm just going to line my eyes I am using Urban Decay 24-7 liquid liner I got this by accident but I actually kind of like it a little bit it's pretty decent like it's a weird brush like this which I'm not used to but I got this line with it. And I'm creating a pretty small wing compared to what I usually do. So now I'm going to apply my mascara I'm using um, the telescopic mascara carbon black. Okay, I just put one layer of that and then I'm taking this smoldering L'Oreal pencil because I ran out of my black pencil and I'm going to be lining my, well I'm going to be tight lining because this makes the illusion of thicker lashes. and then also inside and then what I'm doing is I'm taking this pencil and then also bringing it under my eye you don't have to do this part this is optional then I will take a like equal tools brush and I'll put um, faints and a little bit of crave under my eye just to kind of blend that harsh um, black liner out Don't wear 
worry about um, like it getting messy. You could always clean that up with like a concealer. This is just Max NC15. It's really light. And I'm going to clean this up. And then I will put like a powder under to kind of set that. I'm using the Ben Nye Banana Powder under my eye. Then I'm going to be putting my bottom mascara on.